The French artist Jean Dubuffet said, my art does not seek to include festivities as a distraction from everyday life, but to reveal that everyday life is a much more interesting celebration than the pseudo celebrations created to distract from it. Jean Dubuffet came out of a European sensibility where people were really highlighting the extraordinary and the sublime. And what Dubuffet really sought to do was, was to celebrate the everyday. I first saw the work of Jean Dubuffet at the Tate Modern when I was a grad student in London, and I, I remember it was placed like right by a Franz Klein and a William de Kooning painting. And there was something that made a lot of sense to me because here was this artist working in France in the 40s and the 50s and the 60s, you know, really sort of with this art brute mentality, a real rawness, an almost sort of like childlike way of handling the paint. Historically, the first open sale started out being a sale to celebrate the new, to find like the new hottest thing. And I remember when we were putting together the catalog and this Dubuffet came across my desk. It was called Le Ratique, or The Erratic One from 1961. And you know, Dubuffet is like one of those artists who we always sold in a European context. All of us as specialists and, and curators and art historians alike really felt that Dubuffet was so important for this generation of American painters and the abstract expressionists. So to put a Dubuffet on the cover of a first open sale was actually quite, well, erratic at the time. But indeed, it, it, it sort of championed him as such an important artist. It made such an amazing cover. Just this last May, we set a world record for the artist in the Looking Forward to the Past sale, which really showed the link between Dubuffet and, and artists like de Kooning as well. First Open is such a great opportunity to highlight not only the artists that are young and maybe haven't been on the market before, but also artists who have been working for a long time and to reinvigorate markets that may have been overlooked before.